the floor again. I fell out of the tree because it's so cold. When the temperatures in Florida are dropping, so are the lizards. When temperatures fall below a certain level, it stuns the cold-blooded creatures, causing them to lose their grip and topple out of trees. But when scientists set out to study the lizards during a 2020 cold snap, they found something unexpected. But first, the backstory. Every few years, the National Weather Service issues an unusual forecast. Watch for raining iguanas. That's right, cold weather causes these reptiles to slow down or become immobile. They rain down from the trees where they sleep at night. Don't worry, they aren't dead. They'll snap right back when it warms up. And that brings us back to the scientists and their unexpected findings. While studying the lizards during a cold snap a few years back, they determined that depending on the type, they can tolerate anything between 46 and 52 degrees. When unusually cold temperatures were forecast to hit Florida, they set out again to collect and study the scaled survivors. They discovered the lizards had adapted. They found all the species were now able to tolerate a low of 42 degrees, despite their species' previous inability to tolerate such cold temperatures. We assessed six species of lizards. And despite these species being really different in body size and habitat use, and also in their tolerance levels of, of cold temperatures, we saw that all species were, on average, able to withstand colder temperatures than populations were able to withstand before this cold event. So why does this matter? Scientists predict due to climate change, global temperatures will get warmer, and that will fuel weather that is more extreme. Extreme climate events like this abnormally low cold snap, uh, like heat waves or droughts or even hurricanes, are expected to increase in both frequency and magnitude. So it's now it's really important for us to understand how species are affected by rare extreme climate events. But these new findings show the lizards now have a better chance to adjust to these extremes. For this unique aspect of climate change, it offers kind of a little glimpse of hope and understanding how tropical species might be able to be more resilient than we previously thought.